it's morning time. I'm just kind of going through my rows, doing my my normal maintenance. Uh, this whole row right here is all peppers. I know it's kind of tough to see, but basically they're in hydroponic towers and they're growing to about 12, maybe 14 feet tall at max. Uh, all sorts of different peppers, uh, super hots to uh, sweet peppers, bell peppers. Uh, this whole row of towers is all herbs, uh, mainly basil. A lot of them are flowering right now, so I'm going to harvest some of the seeds, uh, cut off the cut off the, the seeds and let them keep on keep producing let's see uh, I have a trellis right here it's about eight feet tall uh, I've got a lot of cucumbers unfortunately they're kind of getting hit by disease and a lot of a lot of pests right now it's just that time of the season so yeah whole bunch of peppers going on cut the the tomatoes back because I was having a lot of problems with them just having blight right now so I decided instead just to to kind of just do all peppers you can see this guy's got some bacterial leaf spot going on uh, for some reason this variety has been battling it this whole time uh, same right here it's more bacterial leaf spot but you know it happens it's kind of like a a big garden of peppers right now Cheese. what are those those are my potatoes those are tomatoes I eat them yes you do they go to my way okay they go in your leg? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. So you eat the tomatoes. And where do they go? In your leg. They go in your leg? Yeah. I thought they went in your belly. Yeah. Well, which one? Um, this boat. Okay. Show me the tomatoes one more time. I want to take a picture. I eat them. They go in my this. Okay. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, don't pick them. Just hold them so I can take your picture. And say cheese. Cheese. Okay, I think I got a good one. system we have got two strawberries here thanks to Ashish Bansal for investing in this system and Naveen Duray and as well as Zubain John for getting this system done this is a very good investment as well as a fruitful result thanks to everyone thanks for the team this is a teamwork and this was not possible without you all 
now we'll show our hydroponic now system. we'll show the hydroponic system how it has grown up in the last 10 to 15 days we have got the beautiful strawberries here and we are looking forward some more for some more picks as well as some more fruitful results and i guess everyone should go for this hydroponic system this is the best one grow strawberries and other vegetables right at your balcony we are planning to get a good good hydroponic system that would be more bigger to grow more vegetables in coming summers. Thanks Naveen and thanks Zubain for Ini kalau saya ini selangkah maju sedikit, jadi Inovasinya sudah tidak sendiri. tidak menggunakan sumbu, tapi menggunakan raket apung sebagai uh, semai lanjutan. Kalau pakai sumbu tadi dari ini semai langsung tadi ditaruhnya di sini di tepet pak. Di lubang sini ya. Ini harus dibasahi dulu. Biasanya juga pakai ini, Pak. Boleh, pakai air, air, air biasa, biasa juga boleh. Ya, tadi caranya supaya nggak terlalu basah di kepret. <laughs> ini hanya dipotong setengahnya. Ambil ya. Pakai ini, Pak. Kalau pakai ini nggak apa-apa, tuh. So here we have um, our herbal display garden, a garden at GrowX, and um, we have prepared uh, different ways of uh, organic growing. Uh, uh, we have made a uh, basil as a baseline so that we can compare uh, the results between the different growing systems. Uh, at the moment we have autopods uh, just uh, uh, running on by themselves. Uh, some autopods with air domes inside so that the air pump is feeding uh, the uh, bacteria and the fungi with the extra oxygen. And then just the basic normal pots uh, to see the difference of the growing between the systems. Okay, which, which tent are we using? Or lights? Uh, uh, green room uh, uh, 240 times 120 centimeters and uh, for the herbal growing the fluorescent light systems are uh, uh, especially good because they don't pr produce extra heat and the light is exactly what the uh, plants need for the vegetative growing as the herbs usually are doing. And I can see biotaps there as well, yeah? Yeah. Uh, biotaps has been the base nutrient for each of the pot. Uh, pot. So basically, the difference between the systems is only uh, some technical variations, uh, and the uh, uh, growing medium, uh, and the uh, uh, fungi and the bacteria are same on each of the system. Yep. Thank you very much.